Oh, no. Don't fall. Don't fall. There we go. Oh, ho, what was that? <laughs> what? What are you doing? What are you doing, Grave Digger Fire? <laughs> oh, man, the physics are so wonky in this game. Double backflip into a stoppy. Welcome back, everyone, to another exciting episode of Two Can Plays. Monster Jam Steel Titans 1, not Steel Titans 2. And we started, I, I started a brand new account so that I could play the game. Whoa. <laughs> so that I could play the game fresh with a brand new account. Now, I do have all the DLCs, the Fire and Ice, the Gold, and Bakugan Dragonoid. I think it was like five bucks for all of it or something like that. Something ridiculous. We're playing here on Carrot Tail. It's one of my favorite types of tracks, the uh, Rhythm Races. One, th one type of track that I really missed from Steel Titans 2 or in Steel Titans 2. And there we go. First place right off the bat. Now, they're not letting me change my um, difficulty setting, so I'm stuck on amateur. I did get a nice little boost there. And uh, first place, I'm not a boost. I got a lot of credits and I got a first place bonus there. Now, one of the things that this game does do is it kind of encourages you to play as one particular truck and level them up all the way. So I'm probably going to be playing as Gravedigger Fire for a couple of episodes because that's just kind of how the game works. I remember from my previous playthrough. And what I mean by that is like as you level up, you collect these tokens, these little triangles, and the more tokens you collect, the more you can spend on leveling up your truck. And the more you level up your truck, the better you can compete. Uh, I don't want to go through on them all on amateur. I'd like to get up to medium and then hard as soon as possible, but I have to upgrade my truck in order to do that. So here we go. Let's update, upgrade my transmission. Should we do it twice or should we just do it? Let's do, let's do one upgrade on everything. Yeah. And that's all I have money for right now. So uh, I, I have two upgrades on an acceleration, one upgrade on everything else, and we should be good to go for right now. All right, here we go. Rhythm track number two, Western Bandit. I love how I get to keep my fire tires on the outdoor races. Three, two, one, go. Hey, that was a perfect start. Nice. I think my counting was a little fast, but eh, oh well. Sheesh. One upgrade and I'm already just kicking everybody's trash. <laughs> Ouch, I did not land on that one very well. Yeah, so the point of these rhythm races in motocross, what you want to do is you want to get into a rhythm of up and down, up and down, into the valleys and over the top of the, the, the valley. Uh, it it kind of translates a little bit into monster trucks. But, uh, you know, generally you're not going to see monster trucks doing this type of race. Um, and I think that's why they removed it in Steel Titans 2. Then it's a, it's a little long. It gets a little long, I remember, from, the, from my first playthrough. Like, like all I'm doing is holding down the, the uh, accelerator here. <laughs> you know? How far back is everybody, I wonder? Can I turn this around? Can I turn my camera around? Very slowly. Very slowly. Nope. I couldn't turn it around fast enough to see how far back everybody was. But I had a pretty good lead on everyone. First place all the way, baby. And I did get a little bit of a boost, a bonus for finishing in first. Sometimes I notice they'll give you a free upgrade for first place bonus. Not all the time, though. All right. We got more money, which means more upgrades. There we go. We should be able to max this out pretty darn quick, I would imagine. Yeah, I will say that's probably one of the biggest blunders that they made in the first Steel Titans. Uh-oh, I need to fix my camera. Three, two, one, go. Ah, oh, early start. Anyway, one of the biggest blunders they made, I think, was that uh, there isn't a whole lot of variety in the career mode. It's, it's kind of all one type of map all the time. Like, it's, it's all rhythm races which I love. I love these rhythm races. Even though they're not authentic to monster trucks, they're still a lot of fun. Uh, and then it's all like circuit races and then it's all waypoint races and then it's all arena events. And, and like you kind of get a little fatigued from only one type of race. Steel Titans 2 did that a little bit with the Big Show Plus or Big Show. 
Uh, and I, that's why I don't want to really like the big show, to be quite honest. I couldn't sit down and do it all in one sitting. There's no way I would have the patience for it. Wee! <laughs> this is fun, though. But I think Steel Titans 1 did it even worse. Like, it's just so, so monotonous. I love the fire coming out of my tires, though. Whoa! <laughs> big jump. Let's see. I should be able to see the cars coming in around the corner here. Let me see. How far ahead am I? I know this is amateur league. Oh my gosh, I've got such a wide lead on them. <laughs> I know this is amateur league and I am not an amateur at all. I am I am quite the expert, if I may get a little arrogant. <laughs> the, uh, the great, the AI is gonna come after me now. I know it, the AI is gonna get me. <sighs> Hopefully not. <laughs> First place win by a long shot. Oh, not enough to get a backflip that was weird i was like skating on my back that was weird and pardon my voice i am getting over a cold I, it's very very annoying i keep hacking up stuff not that you guys need to know that all right next race hey do me a huge favor though while this race is loading in smash that like button it really does help get these videos out to more people it lets me know that i'm doing a good job and that you want to see more monster jam steel titans all right, here we go. So these rhythm races just get longer and longer and longer. And because it's on amateur. Oh, oh man, I really need to get the timing on that down. Anyway, because it's on amateur league, uh, I'm just going to get a wider and wider head lead on these guys. Uh, it's OK. <laughs> it's OK. We'll make up for it later, I suppose. Maybe I'll do some quick play after this and do some arena events. Do some freestyle, baby. Freestyle! But anyway, this gives me a little bit of time. I can talk about my uh, my trip, my uh, camping trip, where where I managed to pick up the cold. Um, it was a lot of fun. Like, I, I don't know if you guys saw the live. I'll put a link up in the top right corner to the live um, on the beach. I think I talked about it a little bit. I couldn't get the kids interested. We were shark fishing. Uh, but there were some of the older boys were out swimming in the shark infested waters where there were people up and down the coast with lines in the water actively fishing for sharks with chum and bait and all kinds of stuff in the water. And these older boys were out there swimming and, and, and the fishermen were more upset because the boys were out scaring the sharks away, not because they were worried about the boys getting eaten by the sharks, because they, they were fairly small sharks, but still, like, come on guys, what are you doing? <laughs> Going out swimming in shark infested waters. Like, use your brains. <laughs> but yeah, they, they were like 16 year olds. <laughs> they, I guess 16 year olds aren't always known for using their brains. No offense to any 16 year olds out there. Oh, I was gonna try and do a backflip, but I don't think I could make it. <laughs> But that was a lot of fun. NASA was an absolute blast. Uh, I still need to edit that video. I'm gonna, probably going to try and put it up this weekend. Maybe on Sunday I'll have it up. NASA was so much fun. And uh, I want to do I want to do a live stream where I am uh, playing Kerbal Space Program. I think that would be a lot of fun. That's what NASA going to NASA inspired me because we saw all kinds of rockets and the space shuttle and all kinds of fun stuff. We first place. All right, first place. I think I've got one more to go here. Good news is, is I've got my truck fully upgraded. Oh no, okay, so this is different. This is a waypoint race. No more, no more rhythm races. Sweet, okay, so I'm excited about this. It's still in the amateur league, so I think I'll be okay. <laughs> but uh, three, two, one. Oh, I was way late. Oh, dang it. Whoa! The AI in this game is so weird. I remember it's it's even weirder than it is in Steel Titans 2. They bounce you around and oh, crash into you and do all kinds of stuff. Uh, it's fun being in Steel Titans 1, though. I mean, it's... It's it's maybe not the best game in the world, but uh, it's still fun. <laughs> uh, I'm really loving Gravedigger Fire. Let's see, what else did we do? We uh, we went to the beach, and 
And uh, poor William, my son, he got sunburned really, really bad. He took off his shirt and he came in for lunch and I said, do not go back out into the water without putting a lot of sunscreen on. And uh, he did let me put one application of sunscreen on, but then he was out there for a couple more hours and I think all the sunscreen wore off and he never came back in and got re re uh, uh, reapplied. Never reapplied all of the sunscreen, and so he uh, he totally got burned. It was really bad. But when we got home, put some aloe vera on it, and it wasn't too bad. And then that night, woohoo! First place win. I'll tell you about that night in a minute. Nice, got another achievement. Sky high. Okay, cool. Oh yeah, here we go. Gecko Flats. I do remember this one. This was a lot of fun. I think it's a little more challenging than that last waypoint race. They're kind of fun, though. I'm going to finish this episode up with an, an, an arena, uh, a freestyle. Uh, after this arena, or after this waypoint race, though. Go! Ah, still an early start. Ah, it's going to take some getting used to on those, <laughs> those green flags. But anyway, okay, so the night of the beach, a big storm came through and uh, totally, totally broke tents and and uh snap poles and and we had a we had a haul it in early we we um whoa come on come on oh i missed my waypoint no back up back up back up back up got it okay and they're gonna catch up to me aren't they there they are that's all right <laughs> but anyway yeah this big huge storm came in 60 mile an hour winds flattened all the tents and uh, it was it was mayhem. We had to pack up early, uh, and then we had to make the like the five hour drive home, uh, and we didn't get home until like three a.m. It was a rough, rough night. I had to pull over and and sleep for a little bit. But oh, that's there's a rock there. <laughs> Thankfully, I didn't drive like this. Oh, get up, get up. There we go. There we go. <laughs> Thankfully, I saw where all the rocks were in the middle of the road when I was driving home. Oh. It was uh, it was kind of fun. It was kind of dangerous, actually, driving that late at night. But, you know, we were we were just worried like uh, more than half of the the camp didn't have tents anymore. Which is, you know, yes, it, it sucks. But at the same time, those same older boys who uh, who were swimming with sharks, they also slept without a tent on the beach that same night that they were out shark fishing. So they were used to sleeping out under the stars. Maybe they learned their lesson and didn't want to do it again. The worst part about all of it, of course, was the mosquitoes and the biting flies. They were everywhere. Oh my gosh. So obnoxious. Whee. I had so many bug bites. They got into our tent and they would just eat us up at night. Uh, I had I had bug spray and I sprayed it all over, but there were certain areas that are harder to get to, like my backside. And so I had bug bites all down my backside. I am recovering, thankfully. Woohoo, first place. But yeah, I had I had an itchy tushy for a little while there. For a few days, it was quite itchy. That's so many bug bites. Oh, come on. I didn't get first place. I did get first place bonus, but I didn't. Uh, I guess I didn't go through it fast enough. And it was that rock that I hit in the middle. <laughs> I would have gotten more points if I would have uh, finished faster. That's interesting. That, that actually is kind of cool. It gives me more incentive to perform better, I guess, than just finishing first. All right, enough with all that. Ooh, I love the fire effects. Oh, that's sweet. <laughs> nice. And fireworks, too. Anyway, let's do a quick head-to-head -head matchup. Oh, Grave Digger Fire. Man, that is such a sick truck. Why did they not include the fire and ice trucks in Steel Titans 2? I will never know. And there's Great Clips Mohawk Warrior. <laughs> We're gonna do this on easy just because my truck is not upgraded. Good start because I don't know how to do, judge the timing on this just yet. Hey, Chocolate Drive, if you're out there, if you know how to judge the timing on these, let me know, give me your secrets. 
Man, apparently even on easy, I, my truck is not upgraded enough to be able to to beat Mohawk Warrior here. Oh, oh, I think I clipped it a little bit. Do I have it enough? Can I do it? Can I do it? Oh, yeah, just barely. Oh, my goodness. My truck's just not fast enough yet. Nice. Okay, so round one is done. Let's see. We're going into the semifinals. We're going to be going against Son of a Digger. And let's see. I'm going to guess that Max D is going to beat Pirate's Curse and uh, beat uh, beat me. No, he's not going to beat me in the finals. I'm going to beat him in the finals. <laughs> let's find out. Oh, yeah. Grave Digger fire in the house. <laughs> Wiggle the tires for good luck. And there is Son of a Digger. Here we go. Three, two, one, go. Oh, and there we go. Now we're talking. I just got to count it down just right. Okay, got to clip it a little short. Got to draw that line real nice and tight. And my alarm's going off. Never mind that alarm. Never mind. Oh, it's telling me that it's time to win. Time to beat... Son of a digger. I see him. I'm catching up to him. There we go. I got it. Woohoo. Nice. Let's see. Who is it going to be? Max D or Pirate's Curse? Max D. Yeah, baby. Nice. All right. So this is going to be the matchup for the ages, right? Max D versus two can't or versus two can't place. What is versus two can't place versus Grave Digger Fire. Nice. I think they did a better job with the fanfare in this game than they did in Steel Titans 2. I don't know why. It just it just seems better. It seems more exciting. I I kind of dig the uh, the fake wannabe bad to the bone music going on too. <laughs> the royalty free bad to the bone music. Ah, early start. Dang it. Oh well. Come on, come on. Oh, that was not tight. That was not tight at all. The split is only four tenths, four hundredths of a second. Oh, don't you dare flip on me. Ah. Come on, come on, come on. Oh, there we go. I got it. Oh, that was tight. Oh, man. Woohoo. <laughs> we did it. We beat Max D. Nice. Hey, awesome. We got a bunch of a uh, bunch of points, a bunch of uh, tokens to, to spend on our truck. All right, let's finish this off with a freestyle here in Salt Lake City. Ah, oh, man, that's such a cool truck. You know, playing this game has been a bit of a breath of fresh air for me. Ah, perfect. I got that right on. Nice big air. Oh, got a double backflip, but I landed on my back. That's all right. That's all right. Here we go. Let's try this again. Maybe I can uh, come in here with a stoppy. Oh, oh, nice. Okay, got the stoppy. Did not get the moonwalk. I was a little worried. Uh, let's see if I can get some donuts here. Get some donut action. Yeah. Oops. I messed up the donuts. Do some more donuts and a cyclone and I fell and let's get back up <laughs> and they didn't get that as power out. Of course. Why would they? We'll come around over here. We'll get these beacons. We'll hit the log stack here. Nice big air sky wheelie. Oh, no, don't fall. Don't fall. There we go. Oh, ho, what was that? <laughs> What? What are you doing? What are you doing, Grave Digger Fire? <laughs> oh, man, the physics are so wonky in this game. Double backflip into a stoppy. I'll take that. No, don't fall over. Oh, man, we are in first place. That is really good. OK, let's back it up, back it up. Oh, man, what? What is that? Why? Why would you do this? I don't, I don't understand. 
I don't understand the physics in this game. Nice. I don't know what that was, but it was something. They gave it to me. Oh, jeez. Was that a, a front flip? Not quite. No. I'm out of time. I'm out of time. Come on, let's get a donut. Donut, donut, donut. Nice. I got the donut. Okay, got a donut and a cyclone, which means I can now come in here and get a nice big air. Sky wheelie. And come over. Let's go over here and let's get this backflip off the backflip container. Twice? Oh, no. Didn't quite make the second one. That was a good run. That was a really good run. <laughs> a crazy run, but it was a good run. Oh, man. Nice. Okay. First place bonus 307. Got lots of points. I'm, I'm, I should be able to upgrade a new truck, I think. But you know what? I do think that is going to do it for this episode. I do appreciate you guys stopping by and checking it out. Playing through Steel Titans 1 with me, even though it's, uh, yeah, what is it, five years old now? Which is eternity in uh, video game time. Let's take a quick look at Gravedigger Fire doing some donuts there. Oh, man, it's such a sick truck. Maybe I'll do Gravedigger Fire again here pretty soon. Holy mackerel, what? How many was that? Oh, jeez. And all they gave me credit for was a bicycle. <laughs> Oh, man. All right. I better stop while I have a chance. Otherwise, I'm going to keep playing this all night long. Thank you guys for watching. I do appreciate you. Be sure to like and subscribe if you haven't done so already. Be sure to check out the video that you see on your screen right now. And hey, we'll see you guys on the flip side. Oh, and sure. Now you don't do any backflips. <laughs> Later.